a lot. Spirits on this stage like to play jokes on people. They like to follow people, push people, turn lights off and on. It's believed that they're probably workers that used to be on the old sets of the 1920s and 30s, but we don't know. We're here to find the truth and hopefully we get something. Really what it all is is energy. What kind of energy do you put out there and are you able to receive that energy? My name is Johnny, this is Paul, this is Olivia. Uh, we'd like to contact anybody that's in this house. Can you tell us your name? Sometimes those spirits will connect with you because of what you went through in your life, what you might be going through right now. Does it bother you that they're filming something about a poltergeist here? You don't want to show any fear. A lot of bad stuff could feed off that fear. And you want to show that you're serious in helping these people or finding out what's going on. It's the Hodgins, right? Yes. OK, so this is the second floor of the house. There's two different kinds of spirits, it seems like. One is intelligent, and one is residual. The spirits that could do poltergeist or hurt somebody are the intelligent spirits. Do you ever play tricks on the crew? Did it help that they had a priest here to bless this set? It's a really good precaution. But when you do something like that, and something possibly bad is on that stage, it might not react the way you want it to react. If a murder happened, and you might hear someone screaming all the time because it was such a traumatic experience. <laughs> Did it also open up something bad to come into this stage? But then when you get with the non-human kind of spirits, that's when things get really interesting. I heard reports of screaming on a speaker, sounds from below the stage, walking around on the rafters. We're on the catwalk of stage four, one of the oldest stages on a lot. Most of the activity happens up here from what reports say. All right, guys, we're up here to talk to you. What happened to you? You see that the graffiti right there? I'll kill you five times. It's like it's running away. But spirits like to play jokes on you to kind of play with you, get your attention, or, you know, again, to terrorize you. All right, we're going to the basement of the infield house. Uh, WB Archives told us that there's an underwater tank in this stage. So we're going to find out if we can find anything downstairs. There are things that are a lot older than us that have been here before us, I believe. And sometimes you run into that. If we look at a lot of the rocks, there's a lot of etchings from all over the years of crew members and people that were building this stage. The feeling here is much different. So Very we're different, try. yeah. Yeah, it's heavier. We come here with respect to what you've done over the years. We just want to talk to you and know your story or what, what are you doing down here? I felt a breeze. Did you feel? Yeah. yeah. There's no vents, right? No. I've never seen anything like that. There's a lot of graffiti down here on the... 